Hey everyone, Derpy here, and I'm going to be talking about how to kill Draconian Mega Convoys. And these are things we've seen in the last two raids in this one, and are also going to be having the huge Holstor raid next raid. So I'm getting this video out to help people understand how to kill those and how to be most effective. So this is going to be part one. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel for parts two and maybe part three. So first step is bringing the right ship. So here on this slide, I have effective assault, assault ships. The Apollo works in about the 41, the Phoenix and the Skyfire work in the 60s, the Manticore works in the 80s and 100s, and the KD might also work in the 80s. There's other general ships you might be able to take in, but for the most part, you want to use assault ships and assault targets. So these ones pictured on the screen are what's going to work for you. And I'm not going to give out full builds that's going to be in other videos on the internet or whatever else. But there are some things you want to keep in mind when you're di designing your ships. And I have those on screen now. There are some in the defense category and some in the offense category. You can pause this and look through, but I'm not going to read it. These are just things that you're going to want to focus on for designing your assault ships if you uh, want to start somewhere and don't want to use someone else's build. So moving on, what targets are you going to be hitting? So there are four different tiers here, 5, 6, 7, 8 and previously known as the A, B, C, and S sets. And I've shown them on screen here what, what targets are in these. And for example, tier six, you have level 61, 63, 65. Those are a set. And then the bonus level 69 target. And in tier six, you want to use Phoenix or Skyfires with charged armor. Do not take Manticores into the tier six because they're gonna die. You're going to have much better success with Manticores in the 80s than you are in the 60s. Kind of counterintuitive, but how it, how it works. So basically, whatever ship you're using, look at this chart here and take it into that appropriate target. I'm not going to go super in-depth here, but if you, want, if you have a question on this, just leave it in the comments section and I'll get back to you. So now what crews do you want to use on your ships? Well, Gearheads is good for more speed at the start of the battle. Hellfire Heathens and Motal Maidens, those are both good for splash and spread if you have scanner matter cores. You have things like Sea Serpents or Steelheads, those are good for just added defense or turn or evade or whatever else. Um, Midnight Marauders is useful if you have the Darkwing Sick on your fleets or Darkwing CIC on your fleets. Same with Grease Monkeys because that matches speed so you don't have to worry about that. So those will give you extra defense and combat speed and stuff. If you're using a Missile Fleet, Wolfpack, crew probably good for you because it adds critical hits. Fear the Splitzers is good for the um, d double speed at the very start of the battle. Bulls and Brigade will be good especially if you're using missile fleets and might do weird stuff with splash in the in your man Manticore scattergun fleets. But Bulls and Brigade if you want to use it I don't think anyone can roll it anymore. But if you want to use that that'll be useful. Data Destroyers will have critical hits so that boosts damage. Those are just some crews there. If you have questions on any of them leave it in the comments. And now talking about rockets. So pretty much the only thing you want to use rockets on are the huge draconian turret character carriers, aka big fatties. And I like to take, you know, build a long, small pinch, and those only take 10, 15 minutes to build. You can just cook them up in your launch pad while you're doing other stuff, and you go out and you hit it. And you want to drop it right about where I have the picture shot on screen here to hit the missile turret, or you can even drop it slightly later and still hit the missile turret. So you have to lead the ship before you drop drop it. So those are, that's my quick part one video, your arsenal, what you want to bring to these targets. Uh, that's all the time I have for today, so I'm going to have to let you go. But I'm going to have part two and maybe part three posted, so make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel to find those. And leave a like if this video helped you. And as always, Derpy the Cow, signing out, helping you be a better pirate.